Uh, I've been a home group leader for about a year or so. Um, I knew right away the first thing I was going to do is get pizzas, get food, something that guys would like, you know, so it would become easier for me for the Gajaram men. Little did I know that that was not the case. I didn't, I wasn't thinking, and I wasn't thinking straight because I just wanted to make my home group report look good. I'm just going to be honest with you guys. Uh, I, just wanted to, I just wanted to make it seem like I was having revival in my house, like, <laughs> like, like the right in and out, you know, prescription, prayer, boom, get out. Um, but as I was going, I, I just, I noticed that I would have a lot of people come. I would have like six to eight people come, like, but there would be random people, like friends that promised they would go. And then it felt good. But as I kept going, I never connected with people. I never really took the time to say, hey, let's meet up for coffee. Let's meet up and yeah, are you going through anything? Can I pray for you? And as I kept going, I kept going deeper and deeper until I just, I, I didn't know what to do. I had only one guy come. Maybe two, if most. That was my brother. So, you know, um, with that being said, I, I remember I was like, okay, what do I need to do? You know, I, I train, I lift weights, and I remember if, to get to the big weight, what did I need to do? First, I need to do the fundamentals. I can't do big weight if I can't do small weight. The little things, stretching, warming up muscle. And that, that warm-up for me was prayer. As I began to pray, I told God, let me hear your voice when I speak to people. Let me hear your voice and let me give the boldness to when I talk to people in the gym, at my workplace, that will continue to grow and I will continue just to flow through me. And when I did that, I, w- I knew this kid. His name is Alex. He's in my home group right now. Um, I see him every day at the gym. Hey, how you doing? Um, and when I would see him, I would just, I would never invite him to church. But one day God told me, just invite him to church. So I invited him. And he said, okay, he came, he liked it, and he invited Zach. Zach, if you just raise your hand. If you don't know Zach, (laughs) he, uh, if if you don't know Zach, he came from a Buddhist background. He didn't know nothing about church or just anything that we do here. So when I invited him, he got saved and got baptized. When he got saved and got baptized, he invited his girlfriend. She got saved and she got baptized. And when she got saved, she invited her friend and she just got saved last week. (laughs) Let's give it up for Jesus. I just want you to know that God hears your prayers. It's the times where you don't want to go. It's the times where you're tired and you know you got to go to work early, but yet you stay out till 12 o'clock eating Applebee's. You know, it's just... (laughs) And so I'm just saying, how bad do you want it? How bad do you want your business to grow? How bad do you want your home groups to grow? God hears your prayers, but he wants to spend time with you. He wants to hear your voice. You can't have a relationship if you talk to a wall. You can't have a relationship where you just talk to yourself and that's it. Say, God, just cover me, cover my finances, and that's it. God wants to have a relationship with you, and it all starts with prayer. It starts seeking him in the morning. So I'm going to give you just a few tips to just help you guys out if you guys don't know how to get up in the morning, is uh, don't eat too heavy. (laughs) Don't eat too heavy before you go to bed. Um, Go to sleep early, at least a half hour to 45 minutes. That way you can get up and come to prayer for an hour or 35 minutes earlier. Um, Set your alarm across the room. Uh, set an alarm first, actually. <laughs> so, and so just, just be encouraged to come. Just because you've been coming day in, day out, just keep continuing to seek God. Keep continue, if you don't know what to say, just keep praying the same prayer. God, let me reach people. God, give me the consistency to come to seek your face, to seek your glory, so you can use me. When the time comes, I can get up and I can go reach the world. Amen.